In this example, we will look at how to convert JSON to XML that with namespace prefix like this one using converter step. This will be the source payload, source JSON payload, and we will convert to this format. And this are the namespace involved. Let's go to CPI. To save time, I already create a new converter package and convert JSON to XML iFlow. Using sender HTTP. Now we add a new step converter JSON to XML. At the processing, this use newspace mapping is unchecked. No need to check. Uh, I'm not exploring what this does yet, but for all the while to conversion, I'm not using this one. So I uncheck this one. Okay, then this one add XML root element. This is we can use this to add the empty customer. If you come from PIP background, this is message type. Let's take it as example. Okay, then you want to add a name and space. If you try to select, there's no name space mapping defined. You cannot select and you cannot type it manually here. To add that, you need to just click on any blank area. Runtime configuration and add this one. This is the syntax XML NS colon the namespace prefix equal sorry equal to some namespace. If they are multiple, separate by semicolon, then repeat the same pattern. Okay, we're going to use this one only, but this one just also showing here to show you how the syntax to uh, to enter multiple namespace mapping. Now go back to the converter. If we choose select now, you can see there are two that set in earlier step. So now I choose this one and save and deploy. Okay, to save time, I also prepare this already. This is the source payload. And now going to convert JSON to XML. Here it doesn't pretty print XML, then it will pretty print. Or you just add a content type so, so that 
FBI, eh, sorry, so that postman auto recognize that is a application slash XML from here. Then it will auto pretty print for you. Yep, so we achieve what we want. So this is how we convert X convert JSON to XML with mim with namespace. Okay. Thanks. See you in next video. Bye.